Compensation Plan takes you through seven critical steps to formulate a base pay structure and manage your compensation plan. To be effective, compensation must be perceived by employees as fair, competitive in the market, accurately based, and motivating as well as easy to understand. HR professionals might create a compensation plan for their organization, or they might work with an external compensation consultant to do so. A basic model for building a compensation plan includes three functional areas, internal alignment, external competitiveness, and compensation management. Seven steps or actions are organized in these three critical areas of a compensation plan development. Let's take a look at each step. First, internal alignment. Pay comparisons among jobs or skill levels inside a single organization. How differently should the different types and levels of skills and work be paid within an organization? Internal alignment includes the steps of job analysis, job evaluation, and pay policy identification. Step 1, Job Analysis, the systematic process of collecting information that identifies similarities and differences in work. The outcome of job analysis is job documentation, or job descriptions. Step 2 is Job Evaluation, which is the systematic process for determining the relative worth of jobs. The outcome of job evaluation is the development of an internal structure or hierarchical ranking of jobs. Step 3. Determining a pay policy. This is the process of deciding whether the organization wants to lead, leg, or meet the market in compensation. Our next functional area is external competitiveness. This is pay comparisons with competitors, other organizations that hire people in the same or similar knowledge, skills, abilities, or industry. How much do we want to pay in relation to our competitors? External competitiveness includes the steps of market analysis and the development of a base pay structure. 4. Market analysis, which is the process of analyzing compensation data gathered from other employers in a survey of relevant labor market. Gathering external pay data is essential to keep the organization's compensation externally competitive. 5. Base pay structure. This is where the internal structure is developed through job evaluation merged with external pay rates in a simple regression to develop a market pay line from which pay grades and ranges are developed. Depending on the pay policy, the market pay line can be adjusted up or down. Our third and final functional area is compensation management. This is how we make our compensation plan work by addressing individual contributions and creating clear communication with employees. How do we recognize individual contribution that makes pay decisions clear to all employees? Compensation management includes the steps of pay for performance, or what we call variable pay, and communicating the compensation plan to employees. Our sixth step is pay for performance, which determines the use of pay that varies with some measure of performance, such as merit, incentives, and variable pay. And finally, step seven, communicate the plan. This is where we ensure employees understand their compensation and have a clear line of sight between mission, culture, and their total rewards.